What's going on, YouTube? This is Mag Dog TV. We coming back with another one. So it looks like Coach Prime just broke his silence in regards to Amari and Miller receiving more playing time. Who's the starter between him and Will Shepard? I have the video clips. We're going to talk about all that in this video, so let's get to it. Now, you guys know how critical I've been in regards to Colorado reporters, especially with the questions they ask the coaches, the players. It just clearly shows they haven't been doing their homework. They haven't been watching the game on Saturday and whoop the whoop. In this video, I'm going to acknowledge one of the reporters because he asked a very good question and it shows he's been watching and paying attention. He asked, will Amari and Miller play more now after his performance? Listen to what Coach Prime had to say. Hey, Coach, um, just with Omari and Miller, do you think we would be seeing an increased role from him moving forward? Well, the guys are rotating. I think they uh, rotate quite a bit. You know, he got in there and made a tremendous play. But uh, we, we we got a plethora of receiver, man. You could close your eyes and pick. So I don't think it's it's any controversy. I think we know uh, Will Will is, is, is the guy. He's a dog. Uh, Marion will come in and, and do his thing. And this stuff is established at practice, not in the game. It, it's the consistency at practice. That's how we choose who starts and who does not start. Hi, Coach. Well, well, well. You guys heard Coach Prime give the latest update as far as Amari and Miller receiving more playing time. If you guys been watching this video from the very beginning, you already know how this video going to turn out in regards to Amari and Miller. There are a few takeaways from this press conference of Coach Prime speaking about this particular subject that I want to talk about. Number one, he said the wide receivers rotate. Maybe the wide receivers that he knows rotate, but not Amari Miller. When I see Amari Miller get in the game, it's during garbage time. The game is damn near over with. Now, last week, he finally got to the point where he was rotating him, and he get in and he scores because that's who Amari Miller is. Number two, he says that a lot of times he makes his decisions based off of practice. Now, not a lot of times, all the time. That is what he dictate on who's going to play and who doesn't. The videos that I've been reacting to, Amari Miller been productive. Amari Miller been dominating since last season in regards to practice. I mean, you guys know the Heisman, uh, Travis Hunter. Amari Miller did him in practice. You know what I'm saying? And he may not have been as consistent this year. In regards to that, but I feel like Amari Miller is still good enough to play. That's my issue. Let him play. This is a kid that dominated USC last year, and then the next game they bench him for what reason? I have no idea. And guess what? After the season, the kid don't complain. The kid still comes to practice. The kid still comes back and not hit the transfer portal in this era, and he comes back and still give you his best. And you cannot play him or you lack you putting Will Shepard and LeJonte West and all these kids that transfer in, but you just can't play Amari and Miller. That's my problem that I have with Coach Prime, especially with this topic right here. So of course this is gonna be a very passionate video. You know what I'm saying? And he says Will Shepard is the guy. This is the guy that dropped a lot of passes last game against Baylor that could have cost us whether we was gonna win or lose. You guys are going to see later on in the year. You're going to come back to this video just like you did with Michael Welch. When I told you guys Michael Welch was the best running back Coach Prime had, and he was going to dominate, and he went for 65, 70 yards, and he didn't play any this season until week two. But I told you guys before he played what he was going to do, and he did it. Now they're asking them questions about where the hell was Michael Welch. And Coach Prime say, well, we have a lot of good running backs. What you talking about? You don't have no – only running back that you have that's better than Michael Welch is Dallin Hayden. Only wide receiver you have better than Amari Miller is Travis Hunter. You guys are going to see that. If Coach Prime sticks to playing with Amari Miller this season, I promise y'all, y'all going to come back to this video and you're going to say, wow, you were right once again. When have I ever lied to y'all? You know what I'm saying? I don't have no reason to be unbiased. I'm not working for Colorado. You know what I'm saying? I'm being honest with you guys. I work for Google. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to give you guys my honest opinion. In legit opinion, I know football, I know X's and O's. Amarian Miller is the best wide receiver other than Travis Hunter. You guys will see that this season. I also love the fact of how Amarian Miller is treating this situation, as I said before. Hasn't been complaining. You know, just staying patient, staying put. 
And when they called his number, he showed the world why he's the best wide receiver to him. And shout out to that Colorado reporter for asking that. Ain't nothing wrong with that question, buddy. You asked the perfect question because I see the same thing that you see. Drop in the comments and let me know how you guys feel. If you guys like the video, definitely like, subscribe to the channel. Peace.